All right, so Fruits, first off, Fruitsa became a, is a mercenary. Tiber King and helps deal with some other people. Gets the approval of the king to marry his daughter. Then the king is just like, mm, I think it's like, no, maybe I don't like that. Then sends Peppuccino to help, uh, quote unquote, deal with us. Unfortunately, we were too good, defeated him. And I guess we're gonna use the money that we got from all of our mercenary jobs and whatnot to make our own kingdom. And I guess that's gonna be part of a prodigal son. If Sforza thought taking territory would make him safe, he was a fool. The King of Naples looked hungrily northward to the city so easily taken by a rogue mercenary. Sforza needed allies. Sigismondo Malatesta came with a Venetian force, as did Sforza's ever-loyal cousin Micheletto. But the Condottiero needed a more powerful ally. He took his biggest gamble by going to meet an old friend. You might have thought that when Sforza walked into the Milanese court, that Visconti would have ordered him arrested, or that Piccinino would have personally killed him. But surprisingly, Visconti accepted Sforza like a father accepts his wayward son. Sforza and the Duke's daughter were finally wed, and the implication was obvious. Sforza would rule Milan when Visconti died. Whatever the Duke's intentions, this favoring of the prodigal son incensed Piccinino. He furiously tore his contract and stormed out of Milan. If Visconti would not see Sforza for what he was, Piccinino would find another patron. Pledging himself to the King of Naples, Piccinino had one goal, to destroy Sforza. Oh, this story took a turn that I did not expect. All right, so there's us, the villagers, and Peppuccino. Uh, population of 200. Forza is fighting on his own account and will not receive resources from a wealthy patron. Instead, he has conscripted villagers to supply his army. Forza has had time to establish himself in the region, however, and he will need to advance to the Imperial Age to build an army that he can challenge Peppuccino. Pipicino relies on an, an economy outside of his town walls, making him vulnerable to raids. Trade with the Lombard villagers could be profitable, but requires control of the lake. A scout reports that the rivalry between Futsa and Pipicino have brought the two men and their armies to an alpine lake in northern Lom Lombardy. A victory here would give either man a reputation as Italy's greatest captain, with all the power and profitable contracts that status would provide. Peppuccino controls a port town to the southern, southeastern coast of the lake, a mountain castle to the southwest, and two camps to the east and northeast. These positions and his warships allow him to attack uh, Forza's camp for multiple approaches. Peppuccino prefers an army of cavaliers, uh, Contineri, Hand Cannoneers, and Genoese Crossbowmen. He will adjust his tactics to best counter us. Okay, so he prefers using these, but he's not always going to be using these. Uh, which means the only composition of this one is going to be interesting, which also makes me think this is going to be a bit of an annoying mission. Uh, Alright, let's get started. Cousin, it is time for me to make a name for myself. I will join Malatesta in service to Venice. May our family always triumph, and may your victory over Piccinino be swift. Alright, let's get some more stuff going on and about. Um, I guess maybe Archer Line, Arbalesters may not be a good, a good one. Going like Arbalesters and Skirms. Again, Francesco at Dandolo. But you have no cousin here to help you. It is just you and I. Alright. Oh, uh, we do got some fishing chips, that's good. Oh, we only had like a few fishing chips. I said for some reason I said he had more. Guys. What are you doing? Oh, that's a trade cog? What? Alright. You guys can be defensive, I guess. Get some more villagers. 
do you work on that? How about you come over here? Technically work on that, but all of you guys can actually instead start working on sheep. <clears throat> do we have a... Yes. I need more food for that. That's fine, though. Uh, yeah, I got six villagers getting me food. One more. Should be fine. Alright, that's good. Let's get some more people on that. Also get, uh, I guess some actual proper galleys. Are you trying to trade with my own docks? I'm trying to figure out what the AI is trying to do here. Let's move you away, just so that the villagers aren't being stupid. There we go. Uh, because honestly, uh, one thing I learned, don't trust the villagers! Uh, I can also go for the upgrade. Well, 100 wood. There we go, we got some war galleys. I do want to get some upgraded ones, though. Are you going to try to fight me, or are you hoping that I die of boredom? Ooh! Lally take those. Well, I did think about exploring, but I mean, at this point... I don't know what the best option is. Am I going over that way? I don't think... Yeah, that's just walled off. Okay. Uh, grab me that. You guys don't bother with him for right now. Let's just explode a little bit. Uh, grab me that. Oh, this is not walled off. <clears throat> I thought it was walled off by the mountain. Grab you. Oh, population cap. Shoot. Okay, guys, get over here. Okay, yeah, that scout is... Okay, I was gonna say, that scout should die. But they were doing a terrible job of it, so I'm like, oh, maybe they won't. Uh, I do have to be careful, they're all wolves out and about. I should have canceled that villager to get the other thing. That's stupid. That was stupid of me. Is this walled off? That is. All right. Come over this way. So, if that's the case, I could try and use all this. Yeah, just start walking. Over here. Oh, I didn't really hit a monk. Oh, those guys are resistant. Alright, neat. Uh, how about you build me... How about you build that there? You guys can come around. If I can also see if there's any gap. Yeah, like that. Yeah, walk on that, then build that. <clears throat> I apologize. I don't know why. It's just like... Bleh. And f just feel like I'm always... Like, have a hairball that I just can't get rid of. They definitely seem to be... Oh, plenty of resources on the map. That's good. I say, it seems like if I could just get like a castle here, that that would probably handle a good uh, a good amount of things that would be coming my way. Also, I don't have villagers being produced. That's stupid of me. Is 
can't send that there. Uh, Mr. Scout, when you come up that way. Yeah, you guys need, uh, ballistics. Because you guys can't hit anything. Not well, anyways. Okay, this is another one. I thought this was gonna be walled off, but I guess not. Ooh, cows! I'm just gonna bring you guys over here. Real quick. Alright, Mr. Moomoos. Move you guys over that way. Oh, I need gold. Oh, my scout. Oh, yeah, because here he comes now. Go. Oh, wild animal. Go inside. Alright. Uh, so I do have to actually handle a few things. You guys can stop going after the cow. I think we can also get more villagers on farms. Uh, poor cow. I'm not gonna lie, that, that is a little bit sad seeing that happen to the, to the cow. Get rid of the... Thank you. Can also go for more ships. And I really need to get trade going. Uh, you guys can come on down this way. I need gold. Okay, can this get rid of the wolves? Thank you. You guys out. Awesome, you guys can work on that. Not even paying attention, I could actually go to the next stage if I just built a. Uh, wait, I got a monastery. Oh, I need the gold, idiot. Correct. That's why I'm not getting to the next stage. Also, ballistics. Uh, I could really go for a market now I'm thinking about it. Can you do me a favor? Come over here, real quick. Tell me this. Also, I never got that upgrade. Let's grab that. Uh, some elite scones can help out. Definitely. And I'm also gonna need more farms, but we'll get that in a minute. So I'll get that set up. There we go. I got that taken care of. Uh, I also need more houses. I need everything. There we go, that'll be an extra 50 right there. Get that going. Uh, grab that, cause why not? Everybody else walking? Oh, okay, apparently I was- I thought I hit it seven times. Go there. Alright, uh... I think getting to the next age might help out a little bit more than... the other stuff. Sell some of that. Uh, come on, really. No, 
you. Thank you. About time you discard your pitchforks and shovels and build a real army. I prefer a fair fight anyway. Fair fight, he says. Huh. You want to know a fair fight if it hit him in the ankles. Alright, let's grab that. You, that, some of that. Right. You guys still working on that? Right, you guys can actually work on the gold mine next. As we attack out at sea. Uh, I guess I could also be going for fast fire ships. Or just fire ships in general. Because, yeah, I'm moving this fight. That sucks. All right, ballistics. Something else I wanted to grab. We can actually hit. All right, start attacking. Uh, Peppuccino was already in the Imperial Age, so he had better range than my guy did. He also had galleons compared to my war galleys, so yeah. Back it up, back it up. God dang, I need an army. How- wait, what? How are you a form that lost your form? I must have had more from that, I guess. I don't know. Okay, grab that. You. Yeah, because they're just basic fire ships, they're not the good fire ships, so they're not getting me as much as I would like. Oh, let's go upgrade our towers, I guess, although this one might be gone. You, I need more gold. All right, I'll grab you, I guess. Uh, you for that. Yeah, his ship still, unfortunately, have the better range than I do. All right, if you could just get a little bit closer to my, uh, there we go. Well, I kind of lost my navy, but we can build a new one. Uh, let's grab you, so everything is uh, cheaper. And... Let's get some stone set up as well. Get more towers, get some ill slits. Oh, no, no, get that one. I'm gonna be dealing with fights on the water, let's definitely grab that. I also lost all my fishing ships, and I definitely would like more fishing ships. Uh, let's grab you. I need more food. Grab you. Also, thinking about maybe a castle? I don't know. Well, I probably want a castle just with, like, trebuchets, so yeah, I will want stone. Send them down that way. Uh, let's get the elite and get a bunch of you because they just wanted food. I got plenty of that right now. Oh, 
Presto. I mean, thankfully the AI is being stupid, just having the guy march right at us. Uh, I don't know if I need mud holes. This one could be good, though. Grab you. Alright, uh, young lumberjack. Got here, I guess. Grab some more of you. And some of you. Honestly, I'm thinking the galleys might be the better option. Shoot. You're just basic knights, and that's not too bad. Oh, yeah, this town is unfortunately a lost cause. Probably how uh, quiet it's been, for lack of a better word. I mean, how these guys sometimes like to activate, or well, activate, operate. Let's get some more villagers to get uh, cutting. What cutter? Would you like to come down here and build this? I say, I don't have them in there, right? Correct. I haven't been getting attacked from this side, which I'm happy about. Think about maybe we got castle down this way? I don't know. Uh, I do need about another 100 stone, 80 stone to be precise. Which, yeah, I'm just gonna say we'll get that soon enough. There we go. Uh, you guys wanna build, actually, you can go and build that. Those of you can build that, never mind. Let's see if you can walk on that. You think that you are clever with those fire ships? Let us see what happens when they go boom. Okay, so he's getting uh, demo ships. Scatter about. Okay, you guys are getting me gold. That's fantastic. You guys can come down here, I guess, and get me that instead. Cutting games would also not be a bad idea either, but I think I'll hold off and get into that instead. Can you just tell me build that real quick? Anything else I want to grab? Onboard can't towers might not be a bad one. Uh, let's grab the mud holes. Especially if I got a castle this close. Oh yeah, you guys can move back as well. I'm thinking with this castle, I'm actually... Didn't even think about that, I'm gonna get pop capped again. Yeah, come here. That took me 30. 35, 40, 45, 50, plus the castle. There's like an extra 10 or 20. I don't remember how much a castle actually gives you. Okay, so after you guys do that, you can go over there. Oh, your castle, you coward. It will do you no good against my cannons. I still take that. Do I even want that? What do you do? Put Archer. Yeah, I guess why not. I say, I definitely have a good side. Actually, if I'm gonna go for a, for a navy, why not just go for an entire navy? This rate. Wait, they did say try and take control of the water, and I mean, at this point, I can. Just need to find out where the ships are coming from. Alright, you guys were getting me the stone. That's fine. You guys can actually go up this way, I guess. Uh, how about you focus on getting the berries, and then we'll get you the other resources over that way. Oh yeah, but uh, I'm thinking maybe cannon galleons. Why not? They can hit from far away. I can actually get rid of you real quick.
Guys, get that. Thank you. 